Oh, what's up, guys? That's new here, back with the Winnipeg Jets gem mode. We just did the uh, draft in the off season there last time. Um, we got a goalie issue. I don't know what to do at the moment. Uh, so I threw Comrie up on the uh, trading block. We're gonna see how it goes, maybe. Um, so I think I'm gonna just sim maybe a month, see if we get any biters. Um, hopefully we do, anyways. I just want something. Oh, there we go. First round pick for Eric Comrie. All right, let's 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 check her out right away before the first game even happens. All right, let's check this out. So, okay, first rounder for Eric Comrie. Does Detroit need a goalie, though? That's the thing. I don't like doing trades when they're unrealistic. If if a team doesn't actually need a goalie, like, they have Mrazic for sure. And Byzantine and Burke. Do they really need him? I'm going to say no. I'm going to decline that trade. As much as I would love to do that, it's not really fair. Uh, so we're going to decline that for now. Comrie to Columbus for a first and a second. 20, 2021 first and a 2020. Okay, let's check her out. I knew, I kind of figured I'd get a lot of bite on this. Um... Do they need a goalie? Probably, actually. Unless Bobrovsky's still around. Bobrovsky. Bobrovsky! Oh, he is, yeah. They don't have a backup, though, so that actually wouldn't be a bad fit. How old is Bobrovsky at this point? Uh, 31. He's not that old, but... You know what? We probably could... I'd rather get a 2020 first round pick, though, rather than a... waiting a year for it. Because that's not really fair. Oh, they don't have a... They don't have one. You know what? I'm going to take it. Uh, Yeah, I'm going to take it. Let's do it. Doosh. Called up to the NHL. Okay, cool. Go to roster moves. Okay. Um, edit lines. Uh, what's going on? Here? Goalies. Why is there no goalies in the NHL? Huh? In the system. Call up to the NHL. Yep. Edit lines. There we go. I bet that's what it was. Okay. Uh, mm, 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 goalies. Hellebuck. McNiven. You're in there, bud. All right. HL. I feel like McNiven's going to, like, expand rapidly, to be honest. Uh, yep, we'll go like that. Substitute, and we'll quick swap these guys. That's our, that's, oh, that guy's been around for a while. Okay. All right, there we go. Got rid of Comrie. And, okay, that's fine. Uh, I can't see the sim games, though. I don't know what's happening here. Oh, whoops. It's because we're in the AHL right now. It likes to do that. Okay, we're 3 on on 1 to start. Okay, so now that we've made a trade, we can just uh, go right to, like, basically January 1st. I think that should be fine. All right. Uh, scouting. Man, we're doing pretty good, actually, so far. It's good. It's taken a while to get where we want to be, but we're, we're really starting to get there. Look at that wins. 8-5 over Colorado. 7-3 over Columbus. Whew. That's sick. 5, 6, 0, and 1 right now. 7, 0, and 1. Not a bad start. Uh, those are all, like, pretty much non-division games, though. So we'll see if we can uh, continue the trend right now. Malgan. Okay. Don't do that. You can always do better. No effect. All right. Sweet. Is there any AHL? No. Okay. All right. Back out. There we go. Sweet. Nice. Yeah, if we can do good in our division this year, that'll be huge. Um, I think that was one of the biggest problems was for our team last year is that we uh, we had a lot of struggle in the division games. So hopefully, hopefully we can turn around this year. So far, it seems like we're doing a little bit better. Um, we had a pretty bad start, and then we kind of picked it up at the end, but we didn't really do enough to make the playoffs, obviously. So... Um, 
I'm really hoping that uh, we can have a, a strong start and then just continuously keep keep, keep it going. Um, so so far we're doing that, and hopefully, hopefully we can keep it up here. Uh, oof, a couple losses there. Oof, come on, boys. Oh no, no, four in a row. Okay, there we go. Come on, need some more wins here. There we go. Four in a row is a lot. That was a lot of losses. We actually got six and eight, I think. Eesh. Six losses in eight games. Not very good. Uh, let's do defense. Two weeks. Yep, come on. There we go. All right, all right, all right. Overtime loss. That's okay. It's still a point. I'll take it. Chicago. Uh, I don't know. If, I think we might have won, but I'm not entirely positive. December 1st. Okay, that's fine. A2 loss. Oh, man. Ooh. Come on, boys. Oh, no. Come on, boys. <laughs> don't start losing it now. Holy moly. Can't go on those, like, just tears of losses. Just awful. Uh, defense two weeks there. Not a lot of defense in the OHL, but that's okay. Oh, boys. Come on. If we go on like a win and a loss and a win and a loss kind of ratio, but then get some wins here and there, I wouldn't mind, but we're just getting like lost streaks right now. 15 and 16 and 10. 16, 10, 4. Okay. Oh my gosh. Come on, guys. We had such a great start. Don't blow it. Don't blow it. It's <laughs> all we need. Uh, forwards for two weeks. There we go. Loss. Oh, my God. Florida. Come on, boys. Division game. There we go. Carolina's having a good year. 8-4 win. Whew, nice. All right. So we're at January. Um, yeah, you know what? I'm going to stop at January there. That's pretty far. Um, okay. So a uh, pretty good start. We're sitting third in the division. We're 19-12-4. Uh, That's pretty good. Pretty excited about that. All right, Kyle Connor seems to be leading the team right now. We got 35 games. Oops, that's not what I wanted. All right, 35 games. Kyle Connor, 31 points. Kuznetsov with 29. Malgin with 28. Uh, Blake Wheeler with 25. Rosevic with 24. Ehlers is slacking right now. 22 points. Oof. Oof. Come on. Ladd has 22. He's on the third line. Shifley has 20 on the third line. Uh, Morrissey, he's doing okay. I'm more curious to see how our goaltending is doing right now, though. Uh, all right, so Hellebuck has 29 games, 15, 10, and 2, 2.48 goals against. Pretty good. Uh, 9, 1, 6 save percentage, 2 shutouts. That's pretty solid. Um, McNiven, oh, wow. So Hellebuck's up to an 87, and McNiven's up to an 86 so far. He's only had 7 games, but he's uh, 2.54 goals against, 4 and 2. 9, 0, 2 save percentage, no shutouts, but that's okay. Um... That's pretty solid so far, actually. Um, how is... I was going to go look at... You know, we go this way. Uh, player morale. We can see what our overalls are kind of sitting at. Like so. There we go. Go like this. Uh, so what we got? Hellebuck with a boost. Uh, McNiven with a boost. And is that it? Cosmachuk. Lodge. Shifley's a little bit down, but that's okay. Stewart's up, which is great. He's usually never happy. What do we got AHL-wise? Oh, we got a lot going on here in the AHL. A lot going on. Ooh, Spurgeon and Lemure 84s. Sometimes I don't want to run. Okay, we'll do that. Sure. Sorry, bud. Sorry about that. <laughs> Sorry you're unhappy, Lemieux. It's not my fault. All right, so there it is. So far, so good. I think our uh, continuous... I mean, we've made some minor changes here and there. First year, I think we've made too many moves, to be honest. Um, like, getting rid of buff was a big mistake. But um, so far, just kind of riding it out with the minor changes we've had so far has kind of uh, paid dividends right now. So we're 19, 12, and 4. Looking pretty solid. I mean, we're pretty much tied for second almost. Like, we're one point behind the Wild, and we're two points behind St. Louis. So actually, we're pretty much two points out of first. Dallas is right behind us. Nashville's right behind us. Chicago's pretty much right behind us, too. Like, Central's ridiculous, dude. Um, but <laughs> other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you guys 
next time, alright? Thanks for watching, guys!